victims of a fire that killed dozens of people at a church in Giza have been laid to rest. The community left shocked by the seemingly senseless deaths and loss so great it is for some incomprehensible. My son has lost his life. My son is dead. As the church hall fills with bodies to be viewed, mourned and prayed over, the children who died are easy to spot. The smaller the coffin, the younger the victim. Grief turns quickly into anger. My children were stunning. They were angels. I know it is God's decision and I accept it. The only question is why this happened. A faulty air conditioning unit sparked the electrical fire. 5,000 worshippers had gathered for Sunday Mass. People died from smoke inhalation and in the ensuing stampede. The fourth floor of the church was on fire. There were children in the nursery and there was a mass. I don't know what happened, but there were kids and elderly people. We saved those we could. We looked up and saw a lot of black smoke and fumes in the air. Coptic Christians make up about 10% of Egypt's population and are often the victims of discrimination, attacks and hate crimes. For many, the government offers of compensation are unlikely to mean much in the immediate aftermath of a tragedy that has shaken the largest religious minority in Egypt. Zain Basravi, Al Jazeera.